Alright guys, welcome back to another Opera Omnia video where we are about to watch the OPOP number 24. We're going to find out everything that is going to be releasing in the next two weeks for JP Opera Omnia. Now, we already know what is going to be coming out on the 31st, but we're going to be finding out what is coming out for the rest or pretty much what is coming out after the 31st for the next two weeks. So. As always, if you guys do enjoy the video, consider liking it, subscribing, doing doing all that good stuff. Let's go ahead. Let's watch what is going to be happening in JP. Maybe we, we might start getting some explanations on uh, some of like the ultimate weapons on that good stuff. Even though, of course, we won't like fully understand, but you know, maybe a visual would be uh, would be nice. Oh. Thank you for the sub. Great cheats for fun. <laughs> okay, let's go over. I have got to disable that. I said I was going to disable it after my stream earlier today. Alright, let's see here. Okay, alright. Oh, and uh, do know, uh, there will be translations for this as soon as possible uh, by the translator. So I will be making a separate video for everything that was shown in the OPOP. So uh, expect to see that as soon as it is released. So make sure to uh, subscribe or join the Discord or, or do whatever it is uh, that you guys want to do. Hmm, let's see, what can I tell out of this? あの、4月末のね、開発戦略レポート。Oh, they're talking about the Ifrit event. Oh, the Ifrit Lufania Plus event. Huh. So one thing to know is the data miners did find out what the uh, the orb condition is for the Ifrit event. And it's a little weird because like, so from what I was able to understand, and I could be wrong on this, just to, just to let you know. Um, but for what I was able to tell, basically the way it is, like, I don't know, like, it's either, it's like you have to, like, maintain the orb number at a certain amount or, like, between an amount or um, you're able to, uh, like, I don't know. It's so, it's like a, it's, it's, it's different. It's, it's different for, from our usual Lufenia orb conditions. Let's just say that. I'll, I'll leave it at that until we get like the full translations on that uh, as we get closer to the actual fight. By the way, if it looks like Kratos from God of War. Anyways, let's keep going. So yes, now we know uh, Noel is gonna be the character to be getting his uh, BT plus. Uh, we already know all his details from the video that I uploaded, which if you have not seen that video, I will link it down in the pinned comment. He will be getting his alternate skin, of course. Onion Knight will be the other character to be getting his BT plus as well. Sid will be getting his LD, and uh, his LD will be together with Noel. Uh, with his BT, uh, yeah, with his BT and his LD, and then, uh, da, 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 da. let's see. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is the Crystal Level 90. Okay. Oh, and then, uh, for the, uh, for Sarah, Sarah will be together with Onion. I forgot to, I wanted to, uh, mention that. Okay, okay. Okay, they're talking about the they're talking about the passive. So like at, le at crystal level eighty one, you get an increase at your normal your normal regular levels. At crystal level eighty five, you get the ex extension uh, number two, and then at crystal level eighty eight, you get that uh, extension for your C sixty five, and then at crystal level ninety, you get that. The uh, the ability to equip the character with the ultimate weapon. 
覚醒八十八でアディショナルアビリティの曲。うんうん、はい。Okay. Yeah. Right. These will be the first four characters to be getting their crystal level ninety. Okay, now they're talking about the, the Ultima weapons. So, this, this will be the first Ultima weapons that you see on the screen right now. These will be the ones that will be available on the 31st with the release of the Ifrit event. So, I'll leave it up there until I find the, the next one. Okay, this is the prominence core that I mentioned in a couple of videos that I have made yesterday. This is the material needed to be able to limit break the uh, the Ultima weapon uh, uh, to the next level. Oh well, yeah, limit break it, realize it, you know, same same thing. Okay. Oh, this is talking about the uh, the whole like Lufenia thing uh, to be able to farm them uh, with it, it was that that uh, the mistake that I made in the uh, in the video yesterday that I had to re-upload. Um, they're talking about the whole Lufenia thing that you can uh, basically we do the Lufenia fight with uh, like crystal level 90 characters and you're able to like farm up the uh, the the uh, what is it, the palm the the, the orbs, the, uh, the the new orbs. Let's see. Oops. Oops. Get that out of the way. Oops. Ah, messing up. Let's see. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Keep going. Okay, this is just showing you guys like how things work and everything. How, how pretty much how the process is. You need the cords. You need like, uh, according to Ram from the city of DB, you need like 50 cords to be able to create the basic Ultima weapon. Then you need, um, I think it was like 150 to limit break it and then you, and then it continues on uh, five more times until it's at limit break five out of five. Keep going, see if there's anything else that pops up on, 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 on this topic. Um, not, exactly, not, not entirely sure what this means here. Uh, looks like this is something related to the crystal level 90. I'm going to assume that maybe there's going to be one character that's getting crystal level 90 on the on June. Yeah, June 10th. And then on June 22nd, there's going to be two characters. Possibly. I could be wrong on this. <laughs> oh, this is a new quality of life, which I mentioned in one of the videos that I uploaded yesterday. Which you'll be able to see the amount of crystals that you have whenever you click on the uh, on the crystal banner of your choice that you are wanting to form the crystals. Ooh, okay. We are nice. We're getting a chuckerboard, and we are able to get uh, prominent scores. Nice, 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 nice. We're able to get twenty of the cores and twenty eight. Uh, yeah, two thousand eight hundred. A gems noise. I like it. Oh, what's this? On June 15th. Huh. I wonder what this is about. I'm not sure what this is about. Huh. つまりですね、先ほどの特別なパネルミッションと合わせれば、アルティマエポンが一つ作れる。オッケー。こちらの実際のね、詳細は、Let's see what this is. Yeah, not entirely sure what this is. Um, it's a little bit. It's yeah,
different from the usual stuff from uh, OPLP. I mean, it is it is newer stuff, so I'm not entirely sure what's up. Let's see. Uh, can, ooh, we got four tokens for the daily. Uh, for the entire month. Ooh, sweet. Hell yeah. I like that. I'll take that. Let's see. Oh, there's a new character. Okay, so I, I, I don't know how to pronounce the name. But this is the new character that is going to be coming out uh, for the month of June for JP. I'm not familiar with what this character is. But this is from Final Fantasy XII Revenant Wings. So uh, anybody who knows or has played this game can let me know in the comment section below. And can maybe give me a little bit of a, of a background on who... A small little bit. A small tad bit of uh, who this character is. But yes, this is our new character for, for JP. Now, I don't know if this is the only character for this month. But this is so far the newest character for... Uh, that we know so far for JP for the month of June, <laughs> which is uh, different than our than our usual stuff. Actually, is this the first character with wings? I think it is. Huh. And then and it, then I think that's about it. Looks like they're doing uh, just random stuff here. <laughs> hmm. Interesting. But uh, yeah, so other than that, it looks like they're not going to be showing off anything else. So I'm going to assume that this new character might be coming up here in the next two weeks. There's no date shown. So maybe there's most likely there's going to be an in-game notice that should pop up here in the next few hours in JP. So definitely expect a video on that. And uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, other than that, that's going to be it for the video. Again, I as soon as I get translations for the many slides that were shown in this video, I will make a separate video. And then if there is an in-game notice, I will go ahead and uh, post up a, uh, a separate video for that as well. But uh, other than that, like, subscribe, do other good stuff. Thank you so much for watching. And I will catch you guys in my next video.